Hello students, welcome you all in Engineer Salga Gyan and this video is very important to understand the criteria of the credit scores, type of the certificates in NPTEL and very important the weightage of the assignments in NPTEL certifications. So let's start very first thing about the certificates and second is the credits. So let's go with the credits. So if you are applying for the 4 week course, you will get 1 credit. If you are applying for the 8 week course, you will get 2 credit. If you are applying for the 12 week course, you will get 3 credit. If you apply for the exam, it's not about the enrollment. If you are giving an exam, particularly going into the exam center and cracking that exam, only then you will get 3 credit, 2 credit and 1 credit. Now let's discuss about the type of the certificates. If your marks is less than 40, less than 40, all over final score is less than 40, you will be failed in exam and you have to apply again. If your marks is equal to 40 or more than 40 or we can say less than equal to 59, then your exam, you successfully complete that particular course and you will get certificate. If your marks is around 60 to 89, you will get a allied silver button, silver medal for that particular certificate. And if your marks is more than equal to 90, then you will get allied plus gold medal in that particular main course. So your uh, target should be this one. I will request if you work hard and get the golden medal, gold medal into that, that would be very big impact on any other person or any other resume. Like you have the gold medal in any particular course. That's awesome. Now let's discuss about the assign, assignment criteria. So, so uh, for the assignment, assignment, uh, it it uh, gets only the 25% uh, of the final scores okay which is uh, obviously 100 and for the main exam that you have to go to the exam center and have to give the offline exam that is your main exam you have 75% of the final uh, score okay so what is the minimum uh, marks required for assignment and the main so uh, if we look about the 40, at least minimum score, final score is 40. So 10 minimum won't be this and uh, here 30 uh, should be more than 30 or equal to 30. So minimum marks for the uh, final main exam is 30 and for the assignment it is 10. Okay. So 10 plus 30 which is equal to 40. If you are getting 40, you definitely will get the certificate. You definitely will get the, will get the credits. That is which is uh, obviously important credits also because in any uh, BTEC exam and something like that you can give the credits that will give you the higher degree obviously okay that we have already discussed in uh, previous videos right so this is the criteria of assignment and the main exam 10 and 30 more what more 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 important thing that I'm going to discuss right now which very rarely people know about that so you should have that understanding you should have that understanding for the four week okay only three best uh, assignments will be considered okay only three best for the eight week only six assignments will be considered best assignments okay and for the 12 week only eight assignments will be considered so whatever marks you are getting in the, like suppose you have the four week uh, course and have the four uh, assignments in a first assignment you got 30 second you got 40 third you got 50 and fourth is worth 60. So what, what is the mean of this? Uh, third assignment, best third assignment it means it will count from this. Okay. So 40 plus 50 plus 60, which is 110 plus 150 upon divided by 3. Okay. Which is 50 marks. So it is half. I think half. Half we calculate 25%. So it is 12.5 I think something. 12.5. So which is obviously more than 10. So you have cracked the assignments score. Now it's um, the, about the main exam that you have to go or the exam center and give the give that exam. And if you crack that exam, you definitely will get any kind of these certificates. So work hard, guys. It's simple. You have to just give the exam. You have to uh, do the assignments regularly. If you do all that possible things, definitely one day you will achieve whatever you want in life. So thank you so much for watching this video. I'll meet the next video.